what's the origin of of the name Bing? That wasn't on your birth certificate, was it? No. It I'm was Harry. Harry. Harry Lewis. <laughs> no, it's a, there was a comic strip when I was a little boy called the Bingville Bugle. And there was a character in there named Bingo. And uh, I used to go around saying Bingo, Bingo. So they hung the name on me, Bing. So it was way back school days. Yeah, this way back one of before school days, even. <clears throat> when I was, oh, three or four years old. And the Harry, and even Harry Lillis, mm -hmm. lasted quite a while in the early professional career. Yeah. And then just got dropped by the wayside entirely. Well, he came being, yeah. Your mother called you Harry. Harry, oh yes, yes. all the time. <laughs> On the subject of the long-established mutual admiration society involving Crosby and Canada, Bing's views emerged with unabashed affection. It goes back uh, many, many years, Fletcher. Uh, when I was a young boy, my, we lived in the state of Washington town called Spokane, and uh, my father used to take me fishing up in Canada, up near Trail, British Columbia, British Columbia. Penticton. Uh, I can't remember all the names. It's been a few years ago. And that's when I first started to know Canada and to know Canadians. And then I got into show business, of course, and I was uh, on tour a lot, and I was uh, lucky enough to play some Canadian cities like Vancouver, Toronto, Montreal. Never played Quebec or Ottawa. And then in later years, uh, through my interest in hunting and fishing, uh, I was able to uh, visit and spend some time in Quebec on the Cascopedia and the Restigouche for salmon. And then I visited Montreal many times to play golf, exhibition matches, and uh, to fish and play golf at the, the Seniory Club in the Laurentians. I'm trying to take this from the east and work my way west. Oh, it's covering <laughs> a lot of geography. And. Uh, I never did spend much time right around Toronto. It's mostly been the East Coast or the West Coast. Now, to go back a minute, I, I played baseball when I was in college uh, in uh, Medicine Hat in Alberta. I was a second baseman, but uh, I was a good field, no hit type second baseman. <laughs> how, do you, how do you define happiness in your own terms? Well, a happy family. And being part of a happy family, I think, is the uh, most rewarding thing a man can ask for. And being part of a family that uh, produces some worthwhile children who become useful citizens, uh, that's the most gratifying thing in life. Success or money or popularity or any achievement that you can name is nothing compared to the great uh, sense of gratification that you get out of something like that knowing that you've, uh, that some children have resulted from your marriage that uh, are going to be worthwhile people and good people and useful people, people that are going to contribute something to their country and to civilization and to religion, things that are going to endure.